Hey, it's almost a new year. If you want to get lean and save money with what you're spending on senior level accounting salaries and services, you may need to fire your CFO. Now, it depends on the size of your business and a few other variables, but let's get into this. Real quick first, I'm Jim Miller, founder of asterogroup.com, with a modern online accounting firm that growing businesses between one and $50 million in revenue used to get peace of mind with their accounting, profitability, and forecasting. I make this free content to help you to get to the next level, so let's go. Now, more than ever, you want to get lean and cash strong. And maybe you have a controller, a CFO, and after all the employer taxes, benefits, and everything else, you're paying hundreds of thousands of dollars for their services. If you're above $20 million in gross revenue per year, then maybe that makes sense to bring those functions in-house. But if you're in that $1 million to $15 million zone, why not get a fractional CFO for a fraction of the cost? Plus, they come with an entire team behind them. And don't feel bad. If you love your controller or CFO and they're talented with a great personality, I'll hire them. Have them reach out. Everyone wins. Now, your tax accountant, investors, banks, people who want to acquire your company, they all require accurate books. So investing in high quality accounting services is critical if you want to grow your business. Same goes for the senior accounting roles. You need someone to translate the financial picture and to help you see into the future. Your investment in this will pay for itself many times over if you have the right team. So there you go. If you watched this far, know that I really appreciate you. It would mean a lot if you could like, share, and follow this in return. It takes just a second and you help me get the right uh, information to the right people. So reach out if you need help with any of this. Thanks so much.